Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title, we're going to be playing episode 4 around every corner. We are one episode away from the season finale. I also created a poll on my community post to see which game we should play next. So if you haven't voted, make sure you check that out. So make sure you like, come subscribe, put my social media links down below. Without further ado, let's get on to the video. Shit, nobody ain't out here. Episode 4. Be an ass. <laughs> oh! Oh yeah, I'm meeting Krista. Forgot about them just that quick. I just hold it? Uh, no. Because you were talking to strangers. What the hell? No, no, ask me again. Not now. Come just time for again. a little while. We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Uh, no. Maybe I can. Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. I think I'm a good parent. I'll believe. <laughs> His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Then go sit down then. You're right, let's stop. We need to keep moving. Kitty, how much further? Kitty, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? It sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. Okay. Kind of sad with Kenny. After what we found out last episode, I think not. Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? This is set up. Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. Hey, you up there. I know you. I know I saw you. Oh, hey! Okay. Hey, you up there! Damn it, Lee. Keep quiet. <laughs> I thought you said that thing didn't work. Why is Crystal all up on me? Leave me alone. Are you in a tower? Who the hell is this? Is that Who you? is this? Is that you up in the bell tower? I hope not. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? It sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. Hmm? What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Did he call in the walkers? What the hell? You got a thick ass neck. Let's get the hell up out of here then. Let's run. Run! Everybody, run! Yes, y'all just sitting there staring. Like, run! Okay, Kenny, Chuck, Krista, where my gun at? Where's Clem? Oh, okay. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Woo! Nice. Watch out, Kenny! Oh, my God. No! Kenny! Shoot! A little too close, don't you think? Hell yeah, now get up! <gasps> oh! No, Oh, hell no. Ben! What you doing? What the hell? God damn it! Get the. Ooh! Move! Oh, shit. Get down! Get away from Clem! Ooh! Did I get him? Oh, Lord. I'll get 
the door. Oh! I'm gonna leave you behind. What the hell? You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. I was asking you. I was asking Clem. Okay. We gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? It won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Let's check on Clem. So, yeah. I just want to ask y'all something. How y'all like my new setup? You know, if the stream lengths are too distracting, let me know down in the comments. And don't forget about that vote on the poll in my community post. I'll link it in my, my comments. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? I think they did. No, they didn't see us. No, they didn't see us. We were too fast for them. I can still hear them out there. It sounds like they're getting closer. It's just your imagination. I'll feel safer when we're inside the house. Yeah. Hmm. I took on Omid. <laughs> I'm fine. How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. <laughs> we'll take care of it, she's right, looks bad. Mm. She's just worried about you, man. Don't worry, we're gonna get you fixed up in no time. Just as soon as we're inside, okay? Okay. Thanks, man. First, Trying to be... We need to get him inside, now. I'm on it. Sit tight. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Just trying to be the mediator right now. How you guys doing? Not great, so long as we're stuck out here. Will you please go figure out a way to get us inside? Break down the boards or something. Will we be inside soon? Yeah, not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. Oh, shit. It's winter. You know what that means. It's over here. What the hell? Looks like something was buried here. Yeah, a dead body? Of a child? Please don't. Just a doghouse. Look at the dog then. Where are they coming from though? That sound. This ain't important. I'm thirsty enough to drink that yet. It's not important. What about this? The shovel is never not useful. Dude, we got a weapon. Nice. Alright, let's talk to them. Break the boards. How you holding up? How the door's coming? Hey, how you holding up, man? Lee, I appreciate the interest, but I don't think talking about my feelings right now is gonna help us get inside this house. So how's the door going? How's it coming? Find a way in yet? Door's locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. Uh, it wasn't you silent? Think maybe someone's still inside? Nah. We'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. Nice place to hole up. We can just figure out how to get in. Maybe you should have a look around. See what you can find. I got a shovel. What's this? Oh, a doggy door. Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked, too. Oh. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? <laughs> I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, oh. so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Bullshit. Every day's a school day. All right, so where's the dog? Isn't it buried back there? I got a shovel. What about you, Ben? I forgot all about you. Ben. About Kenny, about Clementine, yes. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Yeah, but I never left Clementine behind. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. Exactly. I hear you. About Kenny now. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duff. At least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. Mm. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. 
Yeah, looks pretty solid. I'm gonna go check things out. Let's go. All right. Dig up that dead carcass over there. We got a shovel, rocky talkie, and what is that? A... I don't know what that is. So yeah, the dog be must careful. be dead. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be. You know what I mean? No shit. Yeah, I hear you. Ugh. It looks buried down there. What is that? It's been a while. Stay away. Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Ovi, okay? But I want to just do what I say, okay? Well, I didn't mean it like that. I shut the thing away just in case that thing wakes up. A dead dog. Oh God, the smell. I thought it meant stay away, like. Don't get too close. I didn't think we was gonna see it like that. Ugh. Can't get it off. <gasps> oh, oh. Gee, that is not cool. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Mm. I'm sure you. I said I'm fine, okay? What's going on with them? Jesus. Oh. Okay, take that shovel, cause we might need it. I don't do that anymore. Oh, okay. Dogs you can use it as a, as a weapon, at least. I'm sorry, Clem. I didn't mean to say it like that. Will we be inside soon? Uh, yeah, not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. Oh, I didn't, I didn't mean to say it like that, Clem. I thought I meant stay away, like stay away from the dog. Even though the dog's dead, but still, though. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! Shh, be quiet. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Uh-oh. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Be careful, man. Oh, no. It's no good. I can't get it. Here. Let me try. I think I can. Oh! Are you okay? Clem, are you okay? Say something. She just crawled up in there. Ta da! <laughs> Good job, Clem. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. <laughs> Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Hopefully she doesn't do that again, though. That was weird. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. You might have to leave some people behind. You have to. Okay, I see a family portrait over there. Uh, sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. You keep zooming in on that family portrait. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? Ooh. That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest found of us? Out yesterday. I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. I was honest. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. <sighs> Who gives a shit about the damn radio? Exactly. I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street. And we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there. They're stalking us? At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. I don't like being followed. 
all the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. Omid. <laughs> Let's rest up. We need to go find Chuck. I agree with Kenny. I'm with Kenny on that. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head to the river together. Deal? Suit yourselves, and I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Where the hell? What the hell? He walking out here, zombies. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Okay. Why was Ben walking in like he was a zombie? I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen Omid need anything, okay? Okay. All right, so I gotta check every door? All right. Can we lock it? I should finish checking the house before heading back outside. Oh. We gotta check all this? All empty. It's going nothing but tedious stuff. Like, oh, this is empty. No shit. Nothing. Water's off. See? Uh, there's no power, no water. Probably no medicine either. What else? That's empty too. I can see from the outside. I'm not that hungry. To finish checking the downstairs. Okay, downstairs. Let's see. Okay, let's just go. <laughs> they must be rich. A while ago. This big old house. Alcohol is hiding from Kenny. Probably not the best idea right now. We need to stay frosty. Exactly. That paper. It's a note. Looks expensive. Oh. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. I can't read that note. How's it coming? What you think? That's blocked off. Uh, Clem. Uh, mm. Yeah, it's a family house. They rich. And that dog must be the one that's dead outside. More pictures. Oh. Not exactly my style. We got so many doors up in here too. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. About the boat plan. How's your leg? How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. <laughs> hmm. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. Because right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. All right, let's go. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. I don't want to be here too long. Don't want to make it too long, you know what I mean? Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? Doing that no, right now. I'll take care of it. All right, we got so many doors, though. So many options in this big-ass house. Is it a weapon? Nope. And what's in here? Oh, shit. You ready? Jesus. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> what happened? It's, it's nothing. Cleaning it's supplies? Nothing. I right, said so that's one door. We already checked that door over there. There's two over here. Hopefully it's something good. Alright. Be ready. 
Well, is it in down here? All clear in here. I bet that left is gonna have somebody in it. <laughs> One more to check. Oh shit! <laughs> Get ready. Get ready. It's the bathroom. That's the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Man, I get scared. Got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he dead? Is he okay? <laughs> yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? No, nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell her. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? Mm. What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Who was that? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's oh. wrong? It's Kenny. What well, he did now? You gonna come down? Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. Oh, Lord, Kenny. I hope he ain't dead. I didn't hear no screaming. Going up a little too slow. What was he, a dead Kenny or something in the attic? I hope not. Jenny? I hear flies. Ooh. What is that fly on me? Ugh. Kenny. You okay, man? You going through it. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? What? Oh, my God. What? Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh! Town looks like duck, don't he? A kid it's walking. Just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out of here. It's dark. Oh. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Let's just you can do this. I'll take care I of it. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it like I did before. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. No, I gotta do it. Oh no. This must have been where he slept. He must have starved to death. Yeah, he starved to death. Oh. He was probably too scared to come back out. Just ran out of food, like we almost did. Like we still might. All empty. He probably died of dehydration before he starved. Damn. Oh. That's rough. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. How we get rid of them? Shotgun, stab. What is that? A wrench? I can't tell what that is. Uh, we don't want to cause too much noise. Oh God. Please let it be quick. Please. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. We 
should bury him. I'll take care of it. <sighs> God. This was child death in this game. Who I couldn't do it. But let me know down in the comments if y'all could. I couldn't do it. But I had to. What would y'all do in this situation? Are we gonna bury him next to the dog? Yep. Where the parents at then? Oh, stop walking. Mm. You could be with your dog. God, I had the strength to do this. But let me know in the comments if y'all could. As long as... Oh, there's Clem. I knew it. I got to bury the whole thing. I want to at least give him a proper burial, at least. That's the least I can do. <gasps> what the fuck? Who the hell are you? Are you a walker? Oh! Hey! hey. I knew it. Somebody was stalking us. Stay away from us. You stay the hell away from us, you hear? Lee, what's going on? Somebody's out here, man. <sighs> Someone's watching us. I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't like a man. Good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Did we even finish burying the kid? Jenny? I'm fine. I'm just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing. But the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. Alright, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if we'll need well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because <laughs> I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. Let's look for we supplies. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Well, you search it if you want to. I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place for I more. said I'm done with this house. Oh! <laughs> we can do both. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful, while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. All right. Wait. Can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. 
Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Stay here and help. Um, we can't right now. Can't right now. But you promised we'd go find them when we got here. On the train. You promised. I know I did, sweet pea. I haven't forgotten. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. <clears throat> we all need to stick together as a group. Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if they'll move me if anything. I didn't say yes, so I didn't say no. I just said we'll just so wait. So you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Go look in the house! Stand for No. No offense, Ben, but... No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. <laughs> How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? You've proven so. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. Confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Oh. <sighs> we need to pick up burying the kid. So me and Kenny are off to go find a boat. Great. What if there's no boat? We're gonna be so messed up if there's no boat. All this, all this time, no boat. It's crazy. Infected. Is it better to stay in an empty town? Let me know down in the comments. Is it safer? Getting a little tense with Kenny, which I can understand. I mean, he just lost his wife and his child, so I can understand that. But I'm pretty sure the other ones are feeling a little uncomfortable being around Kenny. You want to talk? Keep an eye for Chuck. You think this probably, I don't know. Hey, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, river's right up ahead. Oh, take it as a no. Son of a bitch! That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. <clears throat> Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Hmm. Uh, spoke too soon. Well, let's see then. What in the hell is going on? I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe they're doing us a favor. Maybe they're trying to distract us. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Whoa. Good one. <laughs> is Kenny the only one with a gun? Where's my gun? Hmm. Let's keep moving. Oh, I see it. That one's crawling back there. <laughs> Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... <coughs> oh, my God. What? No boat? I see one crashed right there. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. It better be. I don't think... Let's just go back. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Come up with a new plan. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Mm -hmm. Screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. <laughs> There's gotta be at least one. One might still be salvageable. Seriously? Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh, yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell you what, if I ever need an expert opinion on American history or on committing murders, I'll be sure to ask. But how <sighs> about you leave the nautical shit to me? I'm gonna let you off. At least one time. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. 
I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. We ain't gonna find no boat. Hmm. This ain't nothing to do with no boat. The cash register. What the hell we need cash for? It's an abandoned newsstand. Is there any supplies in here? It's an abandoned newsstand. Yeah, I know. Still. Anything we can get, at least? It's an old cash register. Has much use these days. Exactly. Why are we over here? I don't know, but let's just keep looking for a boat. What the hell? Are these the town folk? What the hell? Fuck. Was this Stay out. Kind of warning? Don't do something like this. Exactly. And they're still alive, too. Let's leave them alone. Mm -mm. I don't want to shoot and cause noise. Let's go look at that telescope Kenny was telling us about. What the hell? Can we search the car? Anything over here? Nope. Just tedious stuff. Now where's that telescope at? Oh, there it is. Great. Needs a quarter. Hmm, so what the hell? Uh, Kenny, you got any money on you? Maybe that cash register got some. No. Oh well. Hello, beautiful. Oh. Hello to you too. <laughs> Um, do we ask Kenny? <clears throat> you got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. All right. What about these alleyways? Military tag, but what do they mean? Mm. Anything in here? Any trash? Any coin? There's gotta be a coin somewhere. Any coin? Anything on the ground? Nope. Anything down here? Well, I didn't keep the coin from when Larry died. Maybe one of these cars, hopefully. Wait. Locked. I can't use the wrench, whatever that is. Nice. Right, let's go, because I don't like being out here too long in away from Clem, especially with Ben in there and Omi's injured ass. Let's get back to the house. But there's clearly no boat. Could I have used that wrench? Fuck. Oh! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls cracked beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. 
You can't fix it? <laughs> you see it? What the what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Can we check out the telescope, please? Mm. Obviously not. There's nothing here. No sign of any boats down there. <clears throat> All right. Abandoned, like every other place in the city. Plenty of docks, no boats. There's oh, never mind. Salvageable. It was all the way out there. The Talmud Memorial Bridge. Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started. That's the one Kenny was looking at. What the hell? Who are you? What the hell? Who is that? Um, hello? Get down. Get down. <clears throat> that person's coming over here. There they go. building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that noon stand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Uh... Sounds like a plan. All right. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet. Wait a minute. By surprise. If we saw that man that was looking at us earlier, why would he go back and change? Just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. It's like two different people here. That person didn't see here, Kenny. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Quiet. This is as quiet as we can get. Uh. Are you gonna get back up? What the hell? Where'd it go? Um, Lee! Get him! Oh! I thought I clicked it! Man, never can get nothing right! I'm about to die! No! Clem! Clem? Please, don't hurt him! Was that supposed to happen? Get him. They're not from Crawford. It's a woman. Yeah, it is two different people here. Crawford, have you been following us? You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Roll marks for observation. <laughs> don't shoot, Kenny. Kenny, don't. Oh. God. No, he's with us. Jesus, and Clem here too. We can die. Who the hell are you people? Uh. Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly, I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. I'm looking for any trouble. Hi. Oh. <laughs> you guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? What's Crawford? I don't even know what that is. Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened here? You sure you want to know? We should leave because that shot is going to. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, to stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? 
Because Clem? there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Why no children? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survive. While the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. But still, no children. What did Crawford do to them? What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened to them? Well, you met some <coughs> of them already. Oh! Fuck me. <laughs> We should leave, like, now. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed, a drain on their precious resources. That's fucked up. How do you know all this? Yeah. You from Crawford? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. I don't think Crawford's a good idea then. Uh, who's been ringing the bells? Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. Of course. I knew it. Lee, I knew she was the one who's been following us. Fucking with us. Get that <laughs> finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. Oh! I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Mm. I took some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival, they'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart. <laughs> the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. We just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Does it matter at this point? We're looking for a boat. We're just trying to survive. We're just trying to survive. Same as you. And the only way we're gonna survive is by getting on a boat and getting the hell uh, well, out of here. Kenny said it. Not me. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too gotta be something if there was do you think i'd still be here i've been over every inch of this city this whole place is picked clean god damn it fuck hey moron you want to keep your voice down? <laughs> Shit. since you're not getting on any boat i'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before they come on ain't they yep there they go i knew it great Let's get out of here. Isn't that the gunshot must have brought him back? Isn't there another way back to the house? Monica, is there a <laughs> See, I was a little too slow. I would have been gone like yesterday. Is there another way out of here? Don't know, don't care. So what the hell are we supposed to do? I refer you to my previous answer. But you have to help us, please. Oh. At least get Clementine Come on, up. Make it fast. At least Clementine first, yeah. Look, look how they walk it. <laughs> Come on, come on, hurry! Me next. Oh. Of course. Now me. Help me. One good jump. Help me, Jesus. Not him. <laughs> oh god, we am finna die. Oh look a sword. Get in there. Oh, we surround it. Um Come on, Lee! Get your ass out of there! Get open Can't get it open. I'm finna die. Here, use that to pry it open. Cool. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Come on, come on! <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, shit! That thing almost had me! Nothing for the fall down here with me! What? 
check it. Watch out! I knew it. That was close. Clementine, can you hear me? Shh, be quiet. If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. <sighs> we still ain't found Chuck yet. Shit. You got anything on you? Nope. Let's get the hell up out of here. Still I hear Walker down here too. I think. At least I still got the pickaxe, whatever this is. Anything useful? Nope. Okay, let's go. Careful, careful, be quiet. Oh no. Ugh. Is that dead rats? Ew. Don't pick it up. Is there a gun down there? Ain't touching that. <laughs> Next thing I need is some kind of awful disease. I thought they might have had a gun on them. <laughs> Rats with guns. <laughs> Anything useful in here? Lies. Of course. Another sewer? Nope. It needs one of those little thingies. And more dead rats. What's that noise? I knew there's some down here. I need to see my... I need to see. Ooh. They eating somebody over there. Tiptoe. Oh. Looks like some kind of drainage pipe. Uh. Don't turn no more in that direction. Oh. What did he do? Okay, he's gonna draw them over there. Good thing I'm out here and not in there. Hmm, seems loose. Shit. Oh. Lies. I think I could use the pickaxe to. All right, I got it. Took me a while. I just had to go the opposite way. Because the other walkers is just blocking other entrance. Hopefully you don't get me. Now turn it on. Don't turn in that direction. All right. Opposite way. I right, we getting somewhere. Um, they're gonna come this way. And we gotta go back and through the other tunnel. Here they come. All right, let's go, let's go. Hurry up. And we gotta make sure they all go in that direction. Oh, look at the cheats. Let's wait for them to all go. It might take a while. I hope they don't be petty and wait to the last minute to actually add another walker that's coming that way too. While I'm trying to get out of here. That it? I believe that that be it. Alright. Thank God. Why well, I didn't get that one over there? Where's Chuck at? to try to hide out down here. Poor bastard. 
Oh my gosh. You must have saved the last one, Blomazel. You deserve better, old man. Oh no. Poor Chuck. I don't want to shoot it because then I might. Yeah, the pickaxe. Tiptoe, tiptoe. What the hell? I didn't do that. <gasps> oh! Oh no! Oh no! Not the gun! I didn't mean the gun! Oh, they, 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 they come! Oh no! Hurry up. I didn't mean to do that. We ain't got time. What's this? What is it? It's just a sign. Is that a door? I see a door. Locked. Fucking perfect. What this? Shit. Broke off. Damn it. Uh. What this? the hell? Uh, I can use it again? I already tried that. It ain't gonna budge. Uh. Those bars are way too solid. What about this? I can pick that up on my own. What the hell? We already tried that. Um. Then what the hell you want me to do? I can't do like Molly did with that pickaxe. <laughs> oh shit. What the hell? It's a uh, an exit. Yep. What kind of ominous music was that? Let's get the hell out of here. Whoo, child, I was scared, but R. Peter Chuck though, that's sad. Fallout shelter. Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. Oh, supplies. Let's steal it. I wonder if someone's hidden down here. Probably. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. These people were smart then. Let's get in. It's gonna be locked, ain't it? Oh no! Oh! Shit, hello. Ooh. I knew it. Uh, I don't want any trouble. It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes no, not. Him, they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I'm not from I'm here. Not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there. How was it? As bad as here. Everywhere is bad. I'm sorry. You can't <clears throat> trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? It'd be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think. Vernon, what do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? She's sound like Joyce from Life is Strange. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. You ain't gonna shoot me. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> Vernon! Vernon! Relax. You be alright. Ain't clean. Here to hurt you. <laughs> You're really not from Crawford? No. I'm really not. Well, we are. Or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place. You know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. 
No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. Oh. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Ironic. Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? Got ambushed. A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Uh, can you show me the way back? Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group of sick need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Girl, if you don't, I'll kill you. <laughs> uh. Look, sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? Uh, in a way, yeah. Yeah. She's probably already wondering where I am. <laughs> well, we can't have that, can we? Fern, what the hell are you doing? It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned. Ooh, the person of life. Let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go see about your daughter. I thought you were hugging me for a second. Like, what? <laughs> I just met you, dude. <laughs> it won't be long. All you have to do is send me half. What? He look like an older version of Lee. Is that foreshadowing? Support group. Nice. Clementine? Oh, we made Clem? it. Mm, there's Molly. Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. What you doing, Who Snoop? Is around? This? I don't know, some town. Can't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he <laughs> tried to jump me back at the river. Thanks to Fossil. Oh, the doctor. Where's Clementine? Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. Mm? I think you have something that belongs to me. What? Oh. <laughs> I thought it was something else. Well, see, not in front of Vernon. I probably shouldn't have told her that she was my daughter, Please. though. Thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's only me. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? A doctor. This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Oh. Please. She didn't say will you. She said you I'll got it. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. He dead. <laughs> Is this a little boy's room? Oh, Minnie, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. He dead. I work better without an audience. Now, why don't you go find your little girl? All right. Clementine? Oh boy. What's in here? All these rooms. What the hell? Clementine, you in here? Where is she? What's over here? I'll have time to rest later. Ain't nothing important in here. Clementine? Right, nobody's in here. 
Great. Wasting precious time. Clem, you in here? I saw something over there by that window. What's this? Clementine's drawing. Clem's drawings. Where is she? Look out the window. She ain't outside, is she? Don't see her anywhere out there. Uh, no walkers either, though. Doesn't look like she's in here. All right. Let's keep going then. There's a whole bunch of doors out here, though. I don't really feel like looking through them. Clementine, you here? Clem? Hmm. Time for that. Exactly. Like, why well, so many options? Hello. Where's Kenny? Oh, Molly. What are you doing? Oh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. <coughs> Where's Clementine? Don't ask me. I'm not her keeper. Oh. Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Whoa. Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? All right, downstairs. Molly? <laughs> I told you, that girl isn't with me. Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Then why are you snooping around then? Get up. There ain't nothing in here. All right, downstairs. <laughs> Clem? Clementine? And we're going downstairs. Clementine! Come out, please! Is uh, she in here? No, she ain't in here. Jenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. And he drunk. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? <sighs> Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. <laughs> First good thing that's happened since... What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey, man, I tried. But he gave me a look like he was going to rip my face off. Ooh. He won't listen to you. You think he was going to listen to me? The hell with you. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Oh, Lord. <laughs> Y'all seen Clem? Have either of you seen Clementine? Ain't no Damn if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, how did Clementine sneak out of the house? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omi took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I ben? think she went out to play in the backyard. What the hell? On her own. With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be yours. What? I'm like five seconds away from throwing this dude out this damn group. Oh my god. Like, what the hell? Clementine? Clementine! Can't even follow simple fucking directions. Jesus. Is that vent open? I mean, there's a vent back here. Is it open? It is. What the hell happened back here? Somebody got in. It like Clem might have got in there. Is she out here? She can't be out here. Don't scream either. Oh, shovel. Mm. 
We still ain't finished burying him. She can't be in the doghouse, could she? She ain't out here. Uh, what about in here? Cause that vent's open. <gasps> Is she in there? Please. Get the strap ready. It's getting dark outside too. There she is. <laughs> what were you doing in there? What were you doing in there? Exploring? And look, look what I found. More guns, supplies. Let that door hit Clem. <laughs> it's a whole boat. Wow. Oh. This was here the whole time? I know, right? Don't want to cuss in front of them. Here look, speak of the devil. Things may be looking up for us. For once. Let me not jinx myself. Oh, thank you, Jesus. We got some way to get out of here. But how are we gonna get it out of out into the water though without making noise? Hmm. We'll find out. How's Amid doing? Amid's doing okay, as well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound. I think he's got a real infection. Uh -oh. I'm in a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Oh! Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? We'll talk about that. As soon as we figure out how to even get this boat out of well, here. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Bad news. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. <laughs> Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Just stay put. Let's search the streets. Uh, Crawford. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. <laughs> now hold on. Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the mm. hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. We sneak in? There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. The sewer? I know the sewer yep. system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. When did I get that? From the train? I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Sounds That's like a plan. Actually, not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, let's do it. decided then? We're going to Crawford? We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? Mm -hmm. 
I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. Exactly. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? Shit, leave him out. We should go <laughs> tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Are they gonna get on the boat with us too? Cause I don't think they're both gonna have enough room for everybody. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? It's what gonna be dangerous? Crawford? Crawford. <laughs> <sighs> yes, it'll be dangerous. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Same. It could happen. No one else is going to die. No one else is going to die. I promise. Oh, shouldn't have said that. You can't promise that. Exactly. Yes, I can't. Sorry. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, oh. Say what now? Well, you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Might be safer here. I don't think they'll be there. It's dangerous where for you. Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Yeah, I did. Can't I come with you? I don't want to leave her here with Ben and Omid, of all people. Hell no. Yeah. Okay, you can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm going to go get ready. Please don't let me regret this. Please. Yeah, um, that's my question. Now. How are we going to get this boat out of here? Through the gate over there? And how far is the water? It's going to be going to make all that noise. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? Sure. Oh, sorry. I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everything. See? I knew it. trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Who the hell is this? <laughs> this is Bree. She can help us. Um, how? Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Oh. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. All right, stay together, everybody. Please, I'm gonna <laughs> shit. Hold up just a sec. Are you ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Uh, yeah. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? This ain't enough for Did debate. You take her in there and they find her? This is enough for debate, Vernon. Decision's made. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. Oh. Nope. You heard the man. Let's move out. Exactly. Like, leave me alone for once. Damn. <laughs> I might cut Ben a little bit of slack. Probably. I don't know. But the way he been maneuvering lately, I do not know. I don't have faith in him. Wait, so we all leaving on me by himself? This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. Stay together. We stay quiet. We stay hidden. And we stay together. Period. We find what we need, and we 
kick the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? And that part about staying close, it goes double for you. Of course, they made me go first. So they're gonna be there with a gun, ain't they? Mm-hmm. I knew it. Let's go. I like Blackwell. If you know, you know. Where is everybody? Uh oh. There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak out and try to take him out. Kenny? The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. He ain't got my back. Got it? Right behind you. You said that last time. Move to the guard. Oh. I don't know why I stopped moving. I got you now. Wait a minute. That's a real It's a it's a what? What the hell? Ew, y'all saw his face? The hell? It's walkers. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? They all dead, probably. Get oh. inside, fast! Damn, and I brought Clem with me. Get in, we all going different directions. Oh man. Georgia's last city. I knew what to set up. Oh god. Oh, shit. <laughs> fuck. Fuck. Do you think they saw us? Hell yeah, they saw us. I don't think so. I think we're good. For now, at least. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What exactly. always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh, man, we are so screwed. No. This is good. How is this good? What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone in Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. I don't know about this. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? Why are you no. still with us? You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? <laughs> Come on. I think I know which way to head. Like, why are you still here? Thought you were supposed to be with a me. I got a bad feeling about this. Too damn bad. Stick your ass. <laughs> All right, Bree, which door? Hurry up. They got them locked up in there? Just keep moving. Here. Okay, everybody in. This may be the right door, Bree. Shell, your ass getting left behind too. This a schoolhouse. Armory, okay, cool. It's locked. Pictures. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? 
find the key first. <coughs> Give me a sec. Uh. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Uh, medicine. Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Nurse's right office. Here. Nurse's station. Yep, knew it. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Oh, the face just makes sense, doesn't it? Nice save. So then we just need a battery. The auto shop, right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll right. be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two <laughs> people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Oh boy. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. Well, well Clint. Back here. Good luck. Is he standing here with Ben? I, I think not. What's she checking me out for? The hell? I don't want you. Probably. <laughs> Maybe. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben. And oh, no. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? <laughs> You're leaving me with Ben? <laughs> exactly! I'm leaving, ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Imagine. Oh, okay. Back before you know it. A whole eight-year-old looking after a college kid. It's crazy. She is eight, right? Oh, God. okay. So we looking for the battery, right? The motor pool. So according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office, and our battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. All right, cool. Should I go until fire escape? Go to playground. Well, if we're gonna find medicine anywhere, that would be the place to look. I'm not the one looking for this stuff, right? Bree said the entrance to the auto shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. All right, wait. Try go and tell Ben, like, hey, you better watch out, cause I'm not trusting you. Need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? He don't even have a gun. Well, uh, I'll let you get on with it. <laughs> do we even have a gun? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. And he's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. Oh, this shit. Again? It's my fault Doc and Katya got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Are you fucking nuts? You should tell him. I don't have time for this. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? <laughs> Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. And I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real. Real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. Um, you can't just pretend it never happened. I didn't go kill somebody. Well. Look, we need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever going to get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself, for the good of everyone. You hear me? I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. I mean, if you gonna tell me, if he snaps out on you, that's on you. I just know that I ain't had nothing to do with it. Where's Clem? 
You okay, Clem? Yeah. I just hate that I'm being this desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it being in school. Really? Really? I would have thought school would be the last thing you'd miss about all this. No, I like it. Huh. What was your favorite subject? History? Well, what do you know? Mine too. Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? No. Uh... I don't know, sweet pea. But we all have to believe they will. Remember what Katja said back on the farm? She said we'll all be home soon. And now she's dead. But we're not. We're still alive. And we have to keep hope alive, too. It's the one thing none of us can take away. I don't remember what Katja said. But anyway, let's just keep going. All right, trying to go look for that battery. Or was it the fuel? Damn, I forgot. <laughs> but all I know is that Molly's supposed to be helping me. Ouch, that hurts. <laughs> Let's go find Molly. She probably already took off without me. Oh, there she is. Good. Oh, where am I going? The alleyway to the auto shop's down here. You coming or not? Don't rush me. <laughs> a lot of blood in here. Damn, what happened out here? This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? She's she already outside. I told you she left without me. She's the type of person that would do that. Molly, you out here? Damn, be quiet, Lee. Damn. There's someone going that way. Alrighty. What'd that say? Auto shop must be down this way. Nice. Looters will be. Oh! Uh. Y'all saw that, right? Please tell me that was Molly. Please. Anything in here? I just took a guess. I'm scared. <laughs> Somebody just literally ran past us like that. Was that Molly? Nope. Damn. It's jammed tight. Hmm. Anything back here? <gasps> Better not get too close. Do I need something to jam it open with? Shit, love. Mm, back off. You can have them. What are you doing? What were you doing up there? Damn. Oh. Oh. Get him again. Oh. Get him again. Damn. Oh. Shit. Molly? This is personal, I guess. Molly. Ma'am. Calm down. Calm the fuck down. What's wrong with you? What's the matter? Never seen someone kill a geek before? Mm. Not like that. <laughs> Can you help me open this garage? Like medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, we ain't shit now. Oh. Did you find us a way in? Yeah. Nope. But the garage door can't there. open it. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. That'll work. Oh, no. You're gonna die. 
Today would be nice. Oh shit, here they come. Come on. Come on. Come on. Help me. Help me, Jesus. Get in, get in, get in. Kick it out, kick it out. Oh, that one's still alive. After all that beating she was doing on that thing, still alive? Oh, that's we ain't gotta kick it. What if that one starts crawling? Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Okay. Alright, we need to find that battery. Better luck, got one. Must be an anti theft system. Oops. The chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Well, how we turn the thing off so we ain't got to worry about it going off? It looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Can't go over there. It's locked. No way in. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Something to cut it with. I don't know nothing about no audio auto parts. I I don't know. I don't know. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. Mm. Can't reach it up there. So, do we gonna get on top of this truck? And jump into the car? Something you need? Can I borrow your hook? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Well, give me Hilda. Hilda. That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. Now the question is, what am I gonna do with Hilda? Now. Not a scratch. Do I climb on top of this thing, or do I use this to? Yeah. Okay. I don't know nothing about this. Sad but true. I did it. Why the music start up like that? Whoa! Whoa! Probably not good. No shit. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry. There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. Yeah, but hurry up. Still attention to the terminals. All right, unscrew it. It's off. All right, come on. We in time? Got that one off. Let's get it. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Um. Okay, follow me. You just have personnel drive off of that thing. Move your ass. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Help me! Oh Jesus! Great. Now what? The roof. Skylight. Uh. Shoot it. They're already here. Jump. No. Catch me. Woo! Nice. Good. Smart. Alright, we got the battery. I hope everybody else did their part. Okay, so now we're on the roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. <laughs> I wasn't complaining, I was just making a statement, but okay. Damn! Spider Man? Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! Uh. What did you call me? <laughs> well, now that you mention it. Oh! Catch! Catch! Catch me! Okay. <laughs> Imagine if I didn't press that in time. God damn! <laughs> I hope everybody did their part. I did mine. 
Come on. Later. Huh? Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Give give Wait, me the battery. You got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Bye. What? Damn it! What the hell is she doing? I knew it. Oh Jesus. Logan. Where everybody else sit? Oh, there you go. What y'all just standing there for? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. How? Y'all just You sure you two don't need any help? We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Y'all just standing there looking inside. Like they're like a walker in there or something? I need a combination lock for that. That's it. Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Where the hell did Molly go? I can go back out here? There's nothing out here. Not going back out there unless I have a damn good reason. Exactly. They're like, no, 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 not there. Any doors. Now go back into the armory room. Shell casing. I've already been fired. They're worthless. All right. We can't go through these lockers. Little help. What the hell? Little help here. Who's that? other just yet let's get the hell back to the classroom it's a hand with these fuel cans they weigh a goddamn ton good job now we got walkers they still ain't gone to the nursery room yet. yeah we made out pretty good too great work Kenny mm. how you doing with that door not so good here let me give you a hand Get that battery yet? Yeah, yeah, but Molly got it. Molly has. She should be back here soon. She better be. Who are you? Bree? Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. Hopefully. Uh. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah. I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, and I thought there might be some hope, all of this happened. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? That's fucked up. I'll be back. Got some things to do. Good luck. Let's check on Clem. Okay, Clem. Yeah. Where's Molly? She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. Please I don't know. Time. Just sit tight, okay? I need to go take care of a few things. All right. What they doing about this door? <laughs> what do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. I didn't tell you it already. Do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? Be nice if you just stop from cleaning for once. Let's go check on them about them that medicine because they've been going for a while. I 
I hope they at least got into the medical room because last time we saw they were just standing out there like idiots. Is it out there? Ooh. Sounds like there's a shit ton of water around. Damn, let's hurry up then. This place definitely has some major damage. Uh, what's up there? Body, you there? Of course not. I can't climb that. Can't reach it. It's too high up. Oh, and a combination locking for that thing. <gasps> Shit. What the hell? Mr. Vernon must be trapped in there. When did they get in? Shoot. <laughs> oh shit. Here they come. Oh shit. Come on, aim. Damn. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I cannot aim for shit. <laughs> Damn. It's me. Don't shoot. Well, Walker opens the door. They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Combination lock. Great. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe. Locked up tight. Can we bust it open? Whoa. <laughs> We, what can we look? Maybe we should try looking somewhere else for medicine. In Crawford? This place is too overrun. No, that safe is our best chance. All right, then. Yeah, it'd be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other <laughs> choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. So we gotta find a four-digit combination number. What is this? A copy machine. I bet it matters with no power around here. Mm. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination though. Phones probably haven't worked in months. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient. How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Uh, thanks for coming hey, with us. Uh, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us. And for all your help. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these we've got to help each other the most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. Hmm? I heard that. Let's go. go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Hmm. I found a tape. Oh, look. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. I guess his locker outside. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. Hey, that the one Molly was beating up? Brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, shit. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them that it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. Oh, shit. I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this, but I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. 
I'm sorry. Oh. Damn. Well, that doctor's name is Logan. I saw a locker out there that said Logan. Damn it. We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Oops. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Ugh. That's only one tape. Is there any more in here? What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. Somebody got dragged out of here. Safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? Was it the doctor? Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Hmm. Why would I shoot it? Hey, Krista. Yeah. Mm. Are you feeling okay? okay? I'm fine. Why are you asking me that? It's just that you've been looking a little pale the past couple of days. You were throwing up. Oh, come on. You just dug up a rotting dog carcass. I'm surprised we weren't all throwing up. Lee, I'm fine. Quit worrying about me, okay? Worry about Omid. We've got to get him these meds. Are you pregnant? I've got things to do. Yeah. Same here. I don't know. So that's only table. I don't know. Any more? No tape inside. All right, let's go. Let's go to the doctor outside the auto shop. Something like that. These people are corrupt. And they still out here. Nice. Please don't let it be normal walkers. What the hell? Alright, where did Molly go? That's what I want to know. She probably wants to go back to finish beating up that doctor, I guess. Now, how... Uh, climb back up. Right. Can I walk faster? I climbed through here. Yeah. What the heck? <laughs> no way! Oh! Where was it at the first time we came in here? The hell? That thing gonna break next time, I bet. <laughs> the way you just came at me like that. Y'all saw that? Oh, it's still alive. Kill it. Stomp on it. Stomp it. Yes. I don't feel bad. Oh, another tape. You got the combination code? Like just what we need. What's this? Looks like some kind of code. Yes. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. That locker. Shit. Time to go. Mm-hmm. The hell? What about that locker? Oh, another tape. Save me some time. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. 
That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Oh, okay. She's it. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. You got the cold? Oh, shit! What the hell? <gasps> Oh, damn. <laughs> Stop the tape. Stop the tape. <laughs> Stop recording, man. <laughs> we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Why don't you? Uh. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about it. I'm fine. She must be All pregnant. Right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. What about the next tape? We're in business. All right, good. Grabbing this go. Antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for a need. That's all I care about. Well, y'all can go. head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. What time is it? I want to see what that next tape is. Whoa. What the hell? <gasps> Molly. As fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give Phoenix. Why? Overson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Wow. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah. Wow. That's the Crawford way, isn't it? She'll be sleeping with him. Oh, my God. Jeez, Molly, I got some questions for you. Exactly. Let's go. Mmm. Milo's getting around. Let's go. Let's just get out of here. Be here long enough. Huh? Jesus Christ! <laughs> Shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. Hmm. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. Uh, Molly? I'm just kidding. Girl. I got some questions for you. Here you go. It makes sense why she was beating his ass up in the other way. What's that? Nothing. Okay, let's just go. Uh, you lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before. But that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. You were having an affair with that doctor. Hey, from what I've heard, you're not real big on the truth yourself. Besides, I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You but you're trying to go on a boat with us. You can't tell me the truth. Are we really going to do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. 
When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place and their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic. Ah. Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. I kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to... I understand. Somebody said, I don't care. What? I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Mama. I understand. It's pretty. What the hell? Oh, shit, the bells. I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Exactly. Where's the thing that kept that door locked? And where the zombies went? The walkers, I mean. Get the strap, Lee. I don't know what the hell you're waiting for. But yeah, seriously. Weren't there walkers by the door? Oh! oh shit. Sorry, sorry. I Where's Clementine? By those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. Oh, yeah. We still can't open that armory door. You sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. Bust it open. <laughs> um. Uh, Vinge? Isn't it from the Where door? Did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Are you serious? Shit! You son of a bitch! Okay, Molly, don't let me shoot, please. Oh shit! Lee, shoot this fucker! Did I get it? Thanks. Oh. It wasn't me. <gasps> okay. Okay, Clementine. I taught her well. I thought I missed. I thought I shot Molly instead. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh shit! That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. <laughs> Come on, damn you! I'm really considering living, leaving Ben. I really am. This I cannot. Is my fault. All my fault. What the hell is he babbling about? Ben. Talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Yeah, here it is. Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, shut the fuck up. Fuck you, Lee. I can't <laughs> do this anymore. I tried. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Gotcha and Duck. It was all me. It was all me. Oh, good. You gotta open. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. God. got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Kill him! <laughs> Shit. I was gonna kick his ass later. I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife, the child, you gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen mm -hmm. to me. You can mm. get a skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Oh, we just fell out. Group you got here. Shut up, Molly. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Go to a boat. Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure, take a vote. This is America. Fuck it. But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. Merc. <laughs> the boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Oh. Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to O'Neill. And you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Yeah. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. Ohana means family. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Are you? 
I abstain. Can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? Oh shit! Oh, they got her. Damn. Damn. Bye, Bree. Now can we go? Damn right. <laughs> Come on. Grab and go. Man, we'll figure it out later with Ben. Oh my God. That's why I asked earlier, why is he with us? Why is he still here? It's not gonna close, man. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. Oh shit, but make him count. That door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. Didn't you bust the door? Way out down here. Oh, hello. <laughs> it's not gonna hold. Back upstairs. Never mind then. Lee, look. Don't give me the gun. I ain't good at this. I have bad aim. Oh man. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Um, what is that? Uh. Now. The leg. Go back up. Let the free it look up. Oh god. I was doing good for a second though. I ain't gonna lie. First, let's kill them first. Uh I need to leg. Leg. Up. Leg again. I guess not. Oh, it was coming a little too fast. Leg! Leg! Woo! Good! Got it! Let's get the hell out of here! Oh, man! Keep shooting! Okay, you're bringing out the knife. Whatever that is. Nice! Pull him over! Throw him around! Get him! Woo! Oh! Oh! Nice! Okay, Lee! Lee did that shit! Oh, God, okay. Ooh. I was getting ate up back there, though. <laughs> this leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? The train? Never mind. I oh, the herd from the train we weren't escaping from, from last I episode. We can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! I should have known it was going to catch up with us eventually. The herd from the last episode. We met Kristen on me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Chop, chop. Yeah, come on, let's go. The hell? What the hell? Oh! Ooh. Don't die yet. Climb up! Come on, you can do it. There's no time. You have to go now. Fucking around, Ben. Come on. Let go, damn it. Get Clem and the others out of here. Lee. What? Kenny? Oh, he wants you to let go? It's my choice? Lee? We both know. Um. Let me go. Oh, shit. 
him up. At least give it a chance. We won't leave his ass anyway. Just come on. I told Clem nobody's gonna get killed. Well, Bree's dead, but still. From the bell tolls. From whom the bell tolls? Who? I hope I don't regret that later. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Oh! You took too long? He did. Clem, stay back. Don't get any closer. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Oh! Oh! Hey already we got you medicine good I feel like I could use some nice you okay kid you look worse than I do we almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole should have left him behind when we had the chance Ooh. don't look at me what the hell happened out there let someone else tell you I got work to do Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on it. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. All right. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Oh, but you won't. Is it about Bree? Yes, my dear. About what happened. Save your sympathy for someone who's fine. Oh, that's right. What? You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You agreed to come. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up Boston Bree or life? No, it was your choice. A damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here, and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you the kind of leader you are, they're not going to make it much longer. You're kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is going to solve anything. And I may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl, which is why I'm going to make you an offer. What? What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands. Hell no. Take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden. And a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she Walk will away. be if she stays. Get out of my face. Room, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? Be safe. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. As you want to do right now. Period. Get the fuck out of my face. I know face. you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Does it matter? You're not, are you? Just another one of your lies. Who cares? That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? I know that's right. Take your hands off me. You can get out. We ain't taking you on the boat. You can stay here and rock with your other friends. Worse. This is why we don't have big group now. Oh, there she go. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks mm -hmm. for everything. It's been fun. Uh, you should come with us. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded. And I never did like the water. She was like, oh, hell no. I'm sure. I've always done better on my own anyhow. 
much soon. I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. You take care of yourself, Ma. Wouldn't they see you leaving downstairs? What about that battery? She still got it. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. <gasps> Nothing to do with luck. Well, that's one less person. Still, though. I don't know. Maybe Molly making that right decision is a good idea. I mean, being in groups ain't really that great. working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Um, someplace else. Someplace else. Someplace better. Graham, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. He's been. He feels he guilty. Be okay. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's gotten a feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Uh, I'd like to, Clint, but I don't think we. I want to lie to her. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. Oh. I also don't want to lie to her, too, but I also have to be realistic. I mean, Kenny is pretty hell-bent on trying to get out of here. And the longer we wait, the more people will die. Don't fall asleep. Oh, that might happen. Yep, I knew it. Clem gone, ain't she? <sighs> Clement's eyes? Yep. I knew it. God damn it. Clementine? Let's go find Clem. Clem? Where everybody at? The morning after. Are we leaving today? Clementine? Clementine! Everybody gone? <gasps> oh no. Not the hat. You know what that means. How'd she get out? The walkie talkie. Oh, just climb over. Okay. Nice. Let's check first. Make sure it's safe over here first. You, did you? It didn't get me, did it? Okay, we got the walkie-talkie, but it got blood on it. Is that my blood? Oh, that her blood? <gasps> no! 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 no. no. Oh. oh my God, no! Did I get? No! You out here? Where y'all been? Oh no! Oh no! I've been crazy? bit. What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Don't Me? hide it. Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon oh ain't my in the God. house either. What the hell is going on? I've been bit. What blood is that? It's mine. Oh no. Oh my God. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's <sighs> no chance she just wandered off on her own? Then who the hell took her? 
I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Oh, yeah, Vernon. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? <sighs> I need help to find her. Much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's <sighs> with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. I can't. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Really. I can't. Mm -mm. Lee, man. You know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself. If this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't there. What are you talking about? Kitty, man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. Lee, I know you had my back when we first teamed up. You really looked out for me and mine. But ever since then, You've been looking out for yourself more often what? than your friends. I'm sorry, but you're on your own on this one. What about you, Ben? I don't know. But whatever you think is best. It's up to you. Can't make that decision for you, Ben. You have to decide for yourself. I think maybe it's best I stayed behind. I know you don't have a lot of confidence mm. in me. That's okay. I understand. But you've got enough to worry about with Clementine without me screwing things up. He got a point, but still. Kenny. Guess it's just me and you guys. We should go find Vernon. See if he took her. I'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure I can wait there until you get back. Or at least until nightfall. Can't speak for this one. He might not make it to the river. Oh. You're still gonna take her. Even Ben. Figure out what to do about that when the time comes. I got bit. On, I can't man. believe Let's it. Go. No. <sighs> There's just no way. <sighs> this can't be it. This can't be how it ends, man. I can't even pronounce that word. <sighs> I can't believe Kenny ain't coming with us. After everything we... You know what? Oh! Where'd it go? Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Damn. Vernon! Get out here! How long have you been there asleep? doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Where are they going? Unless they're dead. Oh, man. John. Really? No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Maybe this is just a bad dream. Like, like, from the first... The second episode. Or was it the third episode? I don't know. When we thought Clem was bitten, but she wasn't. That horrible dream. Maybe this is a dream, too. We're gonna wake up. Right? Cause that, no. Are you alright? Where are you? And you son of a bitch. Oh. Where have you taken her? you taken her? This is Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. <laughs> Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. 
What do you want from me? Oh, no! No time left. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh, stop cussing. Oh. Oh, we won't get no preview? Okay. The boy in the attic. Did you kill the boy in the attic? 74% killed him. Hippocratic Oath. Did you lie or threaten Vernon? You and 33% of players threatened or lied to him. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? 73%? All right. Did you let Ben fall to his death? 66% pulled him back up. Did you reveal your bite to the group? 80%. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Who came with you? 11%. There's a chance I can go by myself? Shit. Wait. 16% of the whole group? How you do that? Oh, there's no way. I'm about to be 10% when we've been. <laughs> serious? Hell no. Nah. Oh, man. These ain't really that high. How did 16% get the whole group? Did I say something wrong? Yeah, God, around every corner. Oh my God, man. I'm, I'm, no, there's just no way that Lee is about to die. There's just no way. No, mm -mm. Like, this gotta be all just a, a dream. He's sleeping. He's gonna wake up and Clem could be right there waiting for him to wake up to get on that boat. There's just no way in hell we're gonna go out like this. Not before we gotta find Clem. <sighs> man. Why have to be this way? Why did I go out there? Why did I say Ben? And what the hell, Kenny on? I I've been helping him out since the day I met him. I had his back, he had my back. At least there might have been times where I wasn't on this side, but still. Meanwhile, I'm over here making decisions for the group. I'm over here killing kids, burying dead dogs. What the hell? And now he ain't coming to help me. And then now Vernon, well, Vernon, I don't know, where the hell Vernon go? In the group, where they go? Because clearly he ain't got Clem. And Molly ain't coming with us. God damn. Shut the fire ass behind. We, we, we did get the battery, right? I don't know, but I'm going to leave this episode right here. Well, this is the end of the episode. But we got one more episode left. And don't forget about the poll on my community post on what game I should play next. It's Little Nightmares 2, the DLC of The Walking Dead, Firewatch, and Life of Dream Before the Storm. I'll leave them down in the description box down below. But if you guys, thank you all for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, follow my social media links down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.